And what's going on guys, Crazy Pizza Man 21. Uh, this is not a Devil May Cry playthrough, as you could probably tell from the title. And I'll get to why there's a Devil May Cry playthrough in this video. I'll get to that in a second, but what's important right now is what Capcom should do to Resident Evil. Now Capcom, for those of you who don't know, Resident Evil had an early version of, version, I can't talk today, early version of Resident Evil 4. And I'll play the trailer for it in just a bit, because Capcom did release quite a bit of information on the game, but as you can see, drastic changes have been made from the actual game. And I personally think that Capcom should definitely release a full version of the game. Now here it now um, I will play the trailer for the game right now and you guys can see what it is. And we're back. So that was Resident Evil 4, the beta 3.5, which is what it's really called. And um, those of you who don't know is that Resident Evil 3.5 was, of course, like I said before, the cancelled Resident Evil 4. Now, and those of you who will notice, the game did have more horror aspects. Things are a lot different than they are from the actual storyline of Resident Evil 4. But is that necessarily a bad thing? I personally don't think so. I want Capcom to release this as a full game, but I don't want them to do a half-assed job on it and make it... I want them to release the whole thing, because I'm sure they made the whole thing and then they just scrapped the idea. Now I hope they still have it because I want them to release an HD full version of Resident Evil 4. Well, 3.5. And... Since pretty much the story for 4 has already been written, you cannot really change that at this point. But what you can do is make it maybe like a dream Leon has on his way to Europe to rescue Ashley in Resident Evil 4. And now those of you who noticed that there is slight gameplay difference, there is still camera angles like this, as you can see in Devil May Cry, another Capcom video game that I am just playing right now because it's a pretty awesome game. But there is more to why I am playing. And uh, I'll play the... Because there is a gameplay trailer to it. They released like a bit of the game. Like about, I don't know, like three minutes of the game. Three or four minutes. I really don't know how long it is, honestly. And uh, I'll play that for you guys right now.
and we're back so yeah that was pretty much uh resident evil 4 early version now some things to discuss was that you will most likely notice that do i have enough orbs to open this i think it's like 45 Now, those of you who don't know, is that Resident Evil 4, as you most likely noticed, um, it was a lot more horror. It was a little Silent Hill-ish. And also, another factor was the over the- I, I like the transaction between the over-the-shoulder and the classic camera angles. Now, that was very nicely done, and I think that another reason why I liked it. And a lot of people claim it was like Silent Hill. Um, those of you who don't know, Leon was actually supposed to die from going crazy. And those were all psychic visions he was having and shit like that. So, I mean, yeah, that's what I mean, like... And since, of course, Leon is in Resident Evil 5, 4, Resident Evil 6, and so on, they cannot make it an official part of the series. And, um... Yeah, so, and I personally really enjoy it. Uh, the creatures look crazy, the doll things and everything. And, um... All that kind of stuff. I have one more trailer I'm gonna uh, play for you guys right now. Yeah, so that is the final trailer, and, um, those of you who might notice this, I don't know about you guys, but if you'll notice that the reason why I'm playing Devil May Cry is because what what do you think they did with, um, Resident Evil 4 3, aka Resident Evil 3.5? Well, I'm playing it right now. They pretty much turned uh, 3.5 into Devil May Cry. Then again, both awesome games, but I would still love to see a Resident Evil 3.5. So, yeah, I'm a bit disappointed on that end. And if you notice, the areas look amazing as well. The textures and everything, they all just look amazing. And it would have been re very revolutionary to the series. And I really don't get why they didn't do any of that stuff. They should really make it as, as 3.5, or at least as a full game. I don't know about you guys, but I would personally really appreciate that from Capcom, and I am excited for Revelations 2 because Barry is finally back. But, um, would it really hurt to release 3.5? What do you guys think? I personally think they should release 3.5, because personally 3.5 is an awesome game. It really was, and it could have been an awesome game. And to be honest, don't get me wrong, I love Resident Evil 4, it's one of my favorite games. But, I still think it could have been done a lot better, as you can see with 3.5. And another thing to notice in 3.5 is the airship, again referring back to the awesome areas that are in the game. Now the game definitely has a lot of areas that are different from Resident Evil 4, and well, they look a lot cooler, not to mention... Oh shit. Right. They look really cool. Like, personally, the airship looks like an awesome area I would love to explore. You guys notice the airship, I'm sure, in one of the things I showed. Leon's over-the-shoulder transaction between the over-the-shoulder camera angle and the classic Disney Evil 4 camera angle it was a nice touch. And personally, what I think is, when, I'm when I was playing Devil May Cry, and you will notice that the in the first area of the game, that I played before, where the little valley bridge, not really a bridge, little mountainside, I noticed that it matched the backgrounds to Resident Evil 3.5, and you'll notice that the, the, um, 
some of the areas in 3.5 were actually featured in the finished Resident Evil 4, like the dining room area you'll notice, and the knights, which Leon has to dodge later in the game. Like, you know the part, those of you who played 4 know what I'm talking about. Resident Evil 3.5 had an area where you walk through a dining hall, and dine there's a lot of dining halls in the castle. You'll notice a lot of the decor from the castle is taken from, of course, Resident Evil 3.5. I don't think this game in a while, so that's why I'm going to be a bit messy. And then that's pretty much it. I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, favorite, or a subscribe. I wish there were still video responses. Yes, I was watching YouTube when there were video responses to the channel, but I still watched it. So I'll leave you with this. Capcom, release Resident Evil 3.5 as the full glorious game it is. Do not change it in any way. And uh, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys. And um... Just one more word to end this video. Um, if you guys think that Resident Evil 3.5 is not very popular, you might want to think again because I'll show you two videos that this from the first time I watched it a month ago has actually about five more likes than it did last month. And also another thing you'll notice has zero dislikes. And that's just one video. There's another video that is also like that, that is growing in popularity as well, each day with more likes and more views, of course, and another one with zero dislikes, so, Capcom, it is in demand, trust me, as a fan of Resident Evil, it is wanted, it's not unwanted, so I really feel like you should release it. And, uh, 